Hello everyone, Time Rover here, and welcome back to some more a Dwarf Fortress. We are doing pretty well here in the uh, little hamlet of Lantern Bows, I believe is our colony title. Uh, if we set her on our fort here, uh, yeah, the Dwarven Fortress of Lantern Bows. Um, things are going pretty well. Pretty well. Uh, we've got a few things happening. The last episode, we started construction of... What was this? Yeah, I think this was our first temple, actually. Yes. Might actually put this only as uh, citizens. Um and did we actually start construction of some statues? Nope. I think we did actually put in an order. Yeah, rock statues just have not gotten to making them yet, <clears throat> which is unfortunate. But we did finish our smelting area yesterday, which is now producing, in theory, steel. Um, make steel bars, so we should now have a decent amount of of stuff. Um, is this just giving me economic? No, I want. I kind of want this to be economic only. Like I want to split this. You know what? Let's go and take that away. I'm gonna put in a low priority job here to mine out the rest of that. And we're gonna set up two stockpiles. I'm gonna put a stockpile here. Right there, except. And we're gonna put another stockpile here, except. And this is going to be <clears throat> for stones, metal ores. Over here, we're going to have... Um, stone, economic. As I think... Yeah, but to my <clears throat> so this is gonna be all of our um buckstone. So I'm gonna have those be separated. We want two wheelbarrows here. <clears throat> and I think I'm going we'll we'll mine this out and then we'll probably set up some additional storage of items uh in and about this place. We'll see. We'll see. Um, we have this rare area over here. We could sort of split them that way, but I'm fine, I think, with this at the moment. Uh, did we ever trade? Let's pop back up to the surface here. I think we did. Mm hmm. Yeah, we did. We definitely did. So we'll leave that as is. We haven't had any issues. We haven't had any attacks, any uh, problems um, thus far. We are sitting at a 23 people. I don't think we've had any deaths. We do have some people that are a bit grumpy and getting grumpier. Uh, if we take a look here, we've got a bard. I don't know if that's one of our... Might be someone we let in. Um, if we take a look at this person... <clears throat> Burr, Blade Hatches. He wants to admire art, uh, craft objects, be with family, pray, you know, so we need those. If we could get the uh, statues up and running, that would be very nice. Um, I, don't think, I think we just have that set to make rock statues. What are we making? Make shell amulets. It's a still. Stone workers. Uh, hmm. 
I wonder why these... There we go. <clears throat> I guess it just hadn't uh, come around to the new day yet. Uh, merchants are, will be leaving soon. Yeah, that's fine. Made our beds. We're good. If we take a look at our bedrooms, we are looking at what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nineteen. Ooh, we need more bedrooms, don't we? We have a little dormitory here, uh, which I kind of think I'm going to turn into <clears throat> a bedroom, but I think I'm going to want. Let's carve out a few bedrooms over here um, and then to do that i think we're going to create a macro instead of doing it by by hand here uh, da, 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 da. <clears throat> let's do this and we've attracted no migrants so i guess we could do starting here and go down, <clears throat> mine out, over, down, and then, oops, I guess we should start the macro, I guess. All right, so control, record. Macro is recording. Enter. Down. Good. Back up. There. And then... Go down here. Up four. There. And record. Ah, sugar. We needed to have an endpoint. Okay, let's try that again. One more time. I'm gonna start. Start down here this time. All right, control R. Record. Boom. Control R. Oh. <clears throat> oh my goodness. All right. Let's try it again and make sure the hockey was pushed for mining. All right. Fifth time's a charm. Enter. Boom. Boom. Cross over. Go up four. down and then we want to move down to here and end the macro and if we hit control p there we go So that is one two three four five six seven eight nine all right, so that's going to get us a little bit more bedrooms going on here. Um, furniture, beds. Ooh, we'll just grab one of those. Use closest material. Do that. Doors. There you go. So those will get put down. I will zone them. Uh, I have to click multi. Bedroom multi. Done. All right. So people will go and claim those rooms, and we'll set up the other ones as needed. That should be enough for now. Those are 
Yeah, rock statues are coming along. We've gotten nine of them, so let's go ahead and throw down some of these in our temple. And this is our inn, so we'll put them there. And then in our dining area as well. Make that a little bit fancier. Are these no migrants? You have struck Tiger's Eye. Um, I don't know what else we want to put in our non-denomination uh, temple here. Because I don't know if we have... Where do we get the stats on that? Right, if we click here and then assign to a given group. Is it here? Oh, I think actually we have to do it from um, the actual thing, because we have it sir, set as no specific one right now. So I think we have to wait to create another one before before anything. But hopefully those statues get put down and make a little bit things a little bit nicer overall. I don't like where these are. We might have to go and move them. Let's forget, do we have a command to tear down? I think that does it. No. Let's do it. No, yeah, I think we have to actually click, which is super annoying. That in there. And then we are going to need to remove these as well. So we'll get those removed and then we'll figure out a different layout. I think I'm going to keep it like this. Just put move um, the tables over here. Just to keep things symmetrical. Hopefully that works out for us resume construction speaking of resuming let's check our task list and make sure there's nothing else that's been suspended like those things right there they've been suspended everything else is good so we're going to go ahead and let that go all right these bedrooms have been completed furniture bed there All right, so that should give everybody that we currently have some nice bedrooms. Hopefully we can get some of these people to uh, be less grouchy. What are, what are our people doing mining-wise? I think I canceled all of the, the jobs here. Uh, oh, sleep, dig. Yeah, where are you digging out? Okay, so you're digging that out now, which is good. Mm, and what I want to do is I'm going to extend this to be over here. Like that. Except, and then we are going to trim this one back like so. Except uh, box. What did I just do? All right, let's try this. Come on. Do that. Okay, did I fix this? All. Come on. Ooh, I want to remove. I wish you would stop clicking that. What the heck? What the heck? Remove that. 
Thank you. Oh my gosh, that turned into a more difficult task than it needed to be. All right, we stockpile here. We're going to extend this to there, except, and then this is going to... I guess you were set to... Okay, we can do that. It already started that, so none, all. Okay, so that is good. I'm glad to see that done. And then over here, I'm not sure we need any more. No, well, I guess we don't. We have a kitchen here. We've got stills. Food and drink look good. Carpentry workshop. We have some offices. Let's take a look at our leadership here. <clears throat> Everybody is satisfied. Um, our expedition leader is doing quite a bit. I'm just wondering. Talented persuader. Skilled appraiser. You know what? Let's give Rawl our, uh, our broker duties. And do we have anybody... manager wise you know what oh, you're our trader studier might just stay that way oh wait no you're not you know what we're gonna give I'm gonna give this guy the uh, manager duties that means he needs one of the offices um, let's move expedition leader manager so he doesn't need um Anything at the moment? Well, you know what? No, you know what? We're going to keep him. Since he's not really... Do he doesn't need to do anything at the moment. We'll keep him as is. And if ever we need to move him about, we can do, we can do that. So that should be all right. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Jasper, how's our military doing? Let's see. Equip. All right. Looks like we are getting there with uh, some of our equipment. It's nice to see. Everybody's got a weapon. Make steel bars, four steel helms, war hammers are coming along. I guess we finished the... Uh, Shirts? Nail shirt. Get me ten more of those when you can. Please and thank you. Back up here. Is this thing... Did we ever... Yeah, we did set that up. Okay, so we do have a mechanic slot. Yeah, right here. What other workshops do we not have at the moment? We don't have a... Do we have a jeweler? Metalsmith, carpenter, still... No. Tell you what. Let's get a jeweler. Right there, maybe. So we got a petition here. Um... We want someone to entertain our citizens. Sure. I'm going to try not to go overdo, overdo it a little bit with that, so. Uh, siege, screw press. At least in my solo game, I am getting inundated with requests to join um, for entertainment purposes. And it can just get way out of hand. 
Furnaces, clothing. Okay, well, maybe we can start our cloth industry. Mm -hmm. Um, we have a spot for you. Yes. Shops, cloth. Ooh, our first Fey mood. Is it our first? No, we. Well, apparently, because these were not made. I don't think these were made in our in our um in our fortress. Um, workshops, cloth, leather. We'll put a leather area right there, and then we are gonna need to mine out some more areas here. Other than doing this, we're gonna over here. We're gonna have sort of mini areas. Um, do that, and they're all they're gonna be all interconnected. And over here, we'll put maybe like a little storage area for whatever we put in this general area here. That, and then that can continue on and go there. Uh, just claim the craft. All right, what do you, what do you need? Must have bones and rock blocks. Okay. Um, bones. We got fishery, butcher shop. Well, the easiest way to get bones currently. Do you have anybody hunting? No. That's part of the problem here. Um... No one with exceptional skill. Uh, you know what? Well, you're fishing. You're a bookkeeper. Nope, wrong one. Hunters. There you go. We should have... Yeah, we do have some. Now, do we have bolts? Yeah, we got tons of bolts. Okay, so they'll go off and start hunting, in theory. Um, but to speed it up a little bit, let's take a look at our pets and livestock and we butcher something here. Um, the stray mule. Let's go ahead and just slaughter it. All right, we seem to have a lot of dogs. So uh, go ahead and neuter those dogs so that we don't get <clears throat> a bunch. <laughs> All right. There we go. He got his bones. But hopefully we now start to get some hides and whatnot from hunting. <laughs> We should start like because it. I did the um, the melee uh, regiment first. We could have done like a um, the archers first and maybe gotten a hunter out. I just assumed we had someone set up to do our um, hunting. Ba, ba, ba. Are you going off hunting? No. 
Hey, you're just a fisherman. Okay, well, that's, I guess, fair enough. Uh, let's put in a garbage dump somewhere. Do that. Alright, Erdem, our bone carver, has created Zeberdash. Zeber, Zeber... A dash, Lorbum Lizard, a mule bone ring she offers her to us to the Snarling Chambers. All right, well, let's take a look here. Treasure of the Snarling Chambers. This is a mule bone ring. All craftsmen crafts dwarf ship is of the highest quality. It is encircled with bands of rectangular silt stone. Capuchons on the on the item is an image of the Oriole in mule bone. Hmm. Lovely. All right. Did you get anything? Yeah, you're a legendary bone carver now. So they're going to do... The dwarves will do these once in their lifetime. When they actually uh, create something like that. And when they come up onto a fey mood or some uh, recluse thing. They will do that once in their life. And some of the events will trigger the legendary status to be added. Um, but not always. Okay, so these are all done and good. So let's come in here and get workshop cloth. So we got the leather. I want a loom. Put clother. And might as well throw a dyer in there as well. All right, I think the standing orders will automatically butcher. Yeah, my clean fish, automate tannery. Yeah, so the tannery should get... Oh, wait, do we have a tannery? That's a loom. It's cloth. I guess we don't have a... We have the leather area, just not the tannery. Where is the tannery? Is it in the farming? Yeah, right here. Uh, Do we want to put this... Have it on the surf. Do we want to put it on the surface? No, I think we're okay with putting it down here. Tanner. Keep that going. Let's pop up to the surface here. So our roof has been finished, which is good to see. Um, I don't know. What blocks do we have? Jet blocks? Not many. Uh, looks like siltstone is what we have the most of. So let's do siltstone. Uh, I want, um, constructions, fortifications. Seventeen. Um, I'm guessing because there's wood. No, that's not right. Fortifications. There we go. There we go. That worked. Siltstone blocks. Stone blocks. There we go. Now we're going to need a staircase to go up there. So let's do um, <laughs> constructions, staircase. And we're going to put the staircase, I'm going to put it, um, I think, right here. Well, uh, I guess I can't. It would be nice if I could continue up from these stairs. Must... Okay.
Oh, maybe, maybe I can. Oh, looks kind of like I can. Uh, but you know what? Other than doing that. Uh, no. There we go. I want... I'm going to put this somewhere else. Away from those. Because ultimately... I should have left some room in here to wall this in. We might be moving these items because I would like an, a, a wall around this area here. So I'm going to put the staircase right here. And then we'll put a hatch on there as well. Get rid of both of those. That's done. Ish. There we go. That way they can keep going up and up the stairs. Lovely. Alright. Uh, what I want, I'm going to move our trading area somewhere else. Where are we going to move it? Probably just straight down one tile. Just to free up some space for... Um, Just to free up some space for a wall. And this one, we're going to trim that stockpile back. And begin it this way. Same with this one. We're going to trim this one. We're gonna, well, we don't really need to embiggen it, actually. Let's trim you back to say here. Let's trim this one back. Well, this one might not need to be trimmed back. All right. And then Trade Depot, we're going to move you down to here. Yeah, just use the logs. That's going to be fine. And here we want constructions, walls. I want these here. Or oh, out. You know what? Probably didn't need to do all that. Uh, let's do. I'd really like the jet ones. For the interior wall. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in an order for jet uh, blocks. Uh, rock blocks. Jet. And we're going to make the interior area a bit more... That's really annoying. <laughs> Make the interior look a little bit nicer with a sort of an interior wall. Would be nice to have like an interior tower. But I don't know if we we're going to have enough room for that. Let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty two, twenty four. So the middle point would probably be around here. Which 
which isn't where our staircase is. <laughs> but yeah, I'm thinking maybe instead of just walling this up, maybe we create a little bit of a tower. Why is this not a uh, construction? There we go. Let's uh, make sure to chop this tree down. In fact, we're going to want to set up a road around here as best we can to limit the amount of trees that are going to be growing on the outskirts of our base here. Because if we go up a, an area, people can climb trees and jump over uh, walls. See that overhang right there. There we go. Get rid of all that. Good, 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 good. Okay, well, we've gone on long enough. We're going to go ahead and put a cut in the video here. So thanks, everyone, for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. If you are, let me know by hitting that like button. If you want to see more content, as always, I strongly encourage you to subscribe to the channel. 